Here in this problem, the goal, again, when we read the question sentence, here it says, express this travel time in hours and minutes. And if we read the first sentence, given how short the problem really is, we see that it says, Sarah's train journey from Boston to New York, uh, to New York City, excuse me, takes 255 minutes. So if we understand this properly, we are starting with 255 minutes, and we need to turn this into hours and minutes. So when we take a look here, everyone, well, we are taking this as a small unit going to a bigger unit because minutes are smaller than hours. I think we can all agree there. And everybody, what did we say we should do when we are going from a small to a big unit? Correct, division. That is division. We will divide. Now, although we haven't gone through it yet in today's class, I think we should all know this. What number are we supposed to be dividing by? How many minutes are contained in one hour? Correct. 60 minutes encompass one hour. One hour, 60 minutes. So that is the value that we will be dividing by. Now let's get to work here. I'm going to divide 60 into 255. Again, 255 divided by 60. And so now that we're here, everybody, how many times does 60 go and do 255? That'll be four times. So what does the four represent, everybody? We have made four groups of 60. The four represents what? Hours. Yeah, four whole hours. Boom. Now we need to understand what the number of remaining minutes are. 60 times four, that's going to be 240. And when we subtract 255 minus 240, that's a remainder of 15. 15 remaining what? What units should we use there? Correct, minutes, 15 remaining minutes, and there we go. A very straightforward one. I had to kind of you know, toss you a, a, a much more doable one after that very, very lengthy one. But nonetheless, the correct answer here will be four hours and 15 minutes. That would be choice B in this case. Now, everybody, just want to remind you, the only difference between the previous question and this one, in a lot of ways, is just the numbers. It's really just the numbers. 